Hello everybody, my name is Kedemoir, welcome back for another video of uh, Vampire. We're going to continue this series, of course. So, I think we gotta, the only thing we gotta do right now is uh, analyze William's Bishop uh, blood. I'm refill on everything, level 8. Uh, I think I'm good. Let's do this, boys. Let's do, let's analyze whatever we, we gotta analyze. Um, is that it? Yeah, there we go. Let's see what this is all about. So, what, uh, what is it? What do we have to do exactly? Craft. Serums. So what do we need? We need Ferris. Uh, Tetrat. I don't know how we got to get that. Sodium Epiclerate. Solution. So basically, some, some, uh, some sodium, I guess. Yeah, I don't have any of these. So what do I do now? Bishop's blood is much more unstable than human blood and shows extensive mutation. But this is not what happened to me. I must keep on searching. Okay. The sun is about to rise. I can feel it. I'll continue tomorrow night. All right. So we gotta we gotta sleep, boys. We gotta go sleep. I guess I did this too late, too soon for me. I guess. We're gonna be the ter the third uh, night. All right. Uh, let's see what we got. I guess I don't have anything right now. I've already upgraded everything I needed to upgrade. So let's go ahead and uh, confirm, and we're gonna sleep, boys. Uh, major district events. Every night, the consequences of your action may improve or degrade the district L status. It can also be degraded due to diseases spreading among citizens. Okay. Uh, major district events. Uh, if a disease to else elf status drops below the critical, uh, it it will plunge into chaos. It is for you to decide of a district's fate. Okay, interesting. So right now we are serious. If it goes down to critical, no, we are still stable. Okay. Uh, yeah, we were serious actually, and now we're stable because I skipped another night. I already killed two people. I killed uh, this. No, I actually killed three guys. Three patients in itself. Interesting. Uh, I cannot kill these guys uh, though. So I don't know how I could possibly do it. Still searching. Uh, what is it? Okay. So I'm still searching uh, for a way to kill the, stay here until the, the rest of the staff. Board. I'd better learn to hide my true nature from the mortals. But what about my thirst for blood? Oh yeah, that's a big question. All right, so the reg right now it's stable. Let me see. Um, let's see what now. Right now, what is our main mission? Main mission is help the Primbrook Hospital to cope with the epidemic. Answer the door. All right. Seems pretty simple enough. All right. So th is that really all we gotta do? I guess so, boys. Doctors won't be up here to collect you, Doctor Reed. Hurry up. What is it? What does she want? Yes, Nurse Crane. How can I help you? I'm so sorry. I know Doctor Swansea wanted you to rest, but we have somewhat of a crisis. A crisis, you say? Our supply of antiseptics is nearly depleted. I was hoping there was another box up here, but... There's nothing here. The This room is off limits. No antiseptic at all? Uh, this room is off limits. Nurse, this room is off limits, and I'd prefer to keep it that way. Make sure the rest of the staff are so informed. Of course, Doctor. And what about the antiseptics? Or do I inform the staff that you're too busy? I may have a solution. In France, during the war, drugs shortage was a daily problem, and we had to use our wits to overcome the shortages. However do you mean? If combined correctly, certain household chemical products can be used in a pinch instead. Now, where's the hospital storeroom? The storeroom? Fat chance. This is the Pembroke. And space is luxury we don't have. Everything used to be stored in the old morgue. Perhaps I should look there first. Where is this morgue? It's the large building behind the hospital. 
You'll need to go in the back door because it's been sealed off for sanitary reasons. Take this key. It opens a small back entrance at the end of a narrow street. The abandoned mall behind the hospital. A small door at the end of a narrow street. On my way then. Thank you, nurse. Yeah, I already know where the morgue is because I already went and talked to everyone like that is actually in the in the area or, or close to it. So I already know who works there in the morgue. I just I, I was actually trying to I did try one night to well uh, one time to go uh, on the morgue itself, but I didn't have the key. Now I got a key, I guess. Uh, let's go on the left right here. It's over there. All right, boys. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. Um, we don't. Oh, yeah, the morgue is right here. So you can see right here, boys. Right, you can see right here is the morgue, so let's find out where the guy is. Or oh, we still are in the hospital? No, we we are not. Gotta find him. Just gotta find the uh, the harrow, I guess. The uh, the mark objective. Something right here. We can go to. Oh, I think this is it. This might be it, boys. We're running around like right now. Oh. Oh no, there it is, okay. Yeah, there it is, okay. So, oh, we've got some stuff right here we can take. Bullets, nice. It's gonna be helpful. So, uh, go inside the morgue. We've got shotgun shells as well. Alright, we are in the old morgue. Let's see what we got. Actually, I, I was lying, boys. I never went there. I thought the place where I went was the morgue, but I guess not. So, is there anything here? Oh, wait. We've got two objectives right now. What? 49 and 12. So find some ferrous stratus, some quinine, sodium. Okay. So how do I find any of that, really? I'm gonna look around really quick. Uh, the morgue. It says we gotta go up. What about this place? <coughs> <coughs> Let's look around uh, this room, boys. It's been practiced recently over here. Unless I'm mistaken, of course. Okay, what about... Okay, so the scales. The scales right here, boys. Let's kill him! Okay, we got him, we got him. No worries! Oh, fuck! There we go, we got him, he's dead. Similar to the infected William Bishop. Must be the same strain. This sickness moves faster than influenza. I'm gonna take everything I can uh, look. I'm gonna take everything, boys. Oh. Okay. There we go, I'm finding a lot of bullets. That's, uh, that's good, boys. I'm using a shotgun right now, so... Shotgun shells is what I'm looking for. We've got some quinine. That's good. Okay, we've got bottle of alcohol. Not really. I don't really need that. This key will surely grant me access. Underground, underground key. Okay. What's going on? Why am I in combat right now? Holy shit! This guy scared the fuck out of me, boys. Whoa, whoa, whoa! You're gonna chill out. What? I can't. I can't use my special, I don't have any, enough blood. Oh my god. No, oh, he scared the shit out of me, boys. Oh no. Don't do that to me right now. Right. Got plenty of stuff like that. I think I've got everything here. On, no, there's something more right here. Oh. I just wasted a bullet like an idiot. As popular as they are ineffective. But... They do contain iron tartrate, and that might prove itself useful. Okay. So we gotta go all the way down, I know that for sure, but... There's more stuff over here that I can probably take. I wanna continue to look around. Okay, there's nothing here. Other than that. Alright, we're good. So I think we gotta go all the way down, boys. Uh, the underground key. 
There's about to be a lot of, uh... Oh, there we go. There's a lot of skulls right here. I can hear them. I don't know if you guys can hear them. Oh, yeah. These skulls feed from corpses. There we go. The husks of animals. Okay, there we go. Not after We're gonna kill it. Oh, 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 oh. What the... Jesus. When they start attacking... I can't see shit, boys. The camera angles. All right. When did they start... When they start attacking you... They really are going in. Alright, we're gonna take everything. Every, uh, take everything we can uh, see. The ro other rogue skull is over there. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I guess I follow the trail of the rogue skulls. Okay. You better chill out. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, fuck. I gotta, I gotta heal up, but... Here's the thing. I think he's dead. No, he's not dead yet. Okay, now he's dead. We're good. Yeah, I gotta heal up. I can only heal up. Like, I'm gonna regenerate, but I, I gotta drink some blood or stuff like that. It's done. There I go. I gotta use that ability more often against the scouts, ex uh, especially. It's really useful. So I gotta use that more often, boys. Uh, where's the other scowl? Because I'm still in combat. Okay, we're good. Um, anything else? Let's look around right here. Is there any other scowls, really? Let's just look around. Steal everything that we can. Mm, I don't see anything else. There's another door right here. Okay, I just want to look in this room. What do they do to... Why did they leave him here? New citizen, okay. So, citizen investigations. You can start a new citizen quest by tracking it with X, then access your map the uh, to locate the area. To exp okay, it's, to, it's a quest, basically. Find out the case of the dead. Don't really want to do that. I'm going to do these on my own free time, I guess. That's locked. Got a... Uh, Used a uh, listening knife, okay. Don't know if I really want to use that or not. Gotta find more medicine, boys. We gotta find the sodium. I have absolutely no idea where we could find that type of stuff. Especially in the morgue. Okay, um... We got more stuff right here. Like, we found a lot of uh, ingredients, but not what we need. I guess over here. Okay. Gotta be careful. I am hearing them. I hear them. Oh, John Doe. All right. There's boss time, boys. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the hell? He can... He, he, he's got the Shadow Clone Jutsu thing. What the hell? Okay. There we go. I got him. Now, I don't have enough blood. Oh, okay. Alright. He's not that tough, actually. Oh my god, he does a lot of damage. Never mind. He's not that uh, that tough, it's just that he does a lot of damage. Okay, I got him. He only hit me once, though. I was pretty... Making sure that it, not, it was not hitting me that much. Okay, boys. I went ahead and crafted the... What I needed, I just needed to kill a couple more skulls in order to find the sodium again. So that's what I did. F bring the medicine to Dorothy Crane in the patient's room. So we can do that. Uh, it's downstairs, I guess. Let's go downstairs, boys. So we got the serum for fatigue. I even uh, went ahead and did a... Uh, and searched for another... Well, did another one of these serums. There we go. There she is. So we should be fine. I've got what she needed. Finally, you've returned, Doctor. Did you find anything of value? Yes, nurse. You've worked your first miracle, Doctor. Now, this patient here needs immediate treatment. Duty calls? When the storm has passed, I'll show you how to mix the remedy yourself with the same basic ingredients. Many thanks, Doctor. When you finished, you ought to report to Dr. Swansea in his office. He's been looking for you. Seemed pressing. 
Okay. Uh, diseases decrease the blood quality of a citizen. Use the correct medicine to heal them. Speak to the patient in the room behind the authority to check his medical status. Okay. So, is that him? That's the guy right here. So that's the guy we needed to... Hang on, that's a new one. That's a new guy. There's someone new here. Okay, so, we can speak to him. Mr. Goswick. How are you? I'm okay. So, uh... Medical personal checkup. I'm afraid I may, sir. We're gonna heal him up. To be a burden. Give medicine. You are not a burden, sir. Healing you is my responsibility. And you have my gratitude for that. All right. So he's recovering. We're good. Personal questions? No, I don't have anything. I have to go now, sir. But don't. So we heal them up. If you need. Anything. So at least that's a good thing. Um. Okay, talk to Edgar Swenza. Uh, Swenza. Okay, the uh, the doctor. Yeah. Uh, before we do that, <clears throat> there is someone I never talked to before. That's right here. It's actually in the area. What the hell? Remember, citizens' blood will provide you massive XP boost. Look for citizens you of your memori mesmerized level or below and choose wisely. So what is my mesmerized level right now? Uh, so mesmerized level is the one that I can kill basically. Um, I'm level 1 on mesmerized right now. Which I don't know how to upgrade that exactly. So he's m level 2, 4. Is there someone I can basically get? There's nobody I can get right here. I have to upgrade myself, boys, but I don't know how am I supposed to get... Oh, whatever. I'm gonna go talk to the new guys right here because there is some new... New people around the area. I never noticed before. There must be really, like, really new. This place. Okay, wh who is this guy? It's unknown. I can't talk to that person, though. Yeah, I can't talk to that person, so it's not too good for me. All right, anyways, boys, I can't mesmerize any uh, anyone, so really, right now, what I'm gonna do, what I'm gonna have to do is, um, I guess I'm gonna have to talk to the doctor and see what he uh, see what he wants. Okay, where is he exactly? I think he's over there, right? That's his door right here. Please, Jonathan, come in. Fascinating, is it not? In the last decade, so many mysteries have been brought to light with our microscopes. The human body, biology's penultimate frontier. The more we explore its boundaries, the less we're able to trace a clear line between life and death. <laughs> The, you, my friend, have a foot in both countries. The view must be vertiginous. It's at least as vertiginous as chatting about vampires with you, I would say. This must be all so new to you. This area of town, the hospital, a brand new life. How stimulating it must be. I wish I could share your enthusiasm, Dr. Swansea. But my condition defies scientific categorization. Undead? Unalive? Immortality defies logic. I cannot express my thrill at this serendipitous turn of events. The world's most eminent specialist in blood transfusions, a vampire. One might say a gift from heaven. Yeah. This is no gift. Your words bring comfort. I'm a, I'm a living paradox. There is an absurd poetry to my situation. Physician, heal thyself. Forgive me. I've been an admirer of your work for a long time, and now you are so much more than a brilliant physician. And please, call me Edgar. Alright. No need to apologize. This is not amusing. Uh, this is not amusing. Thank you. But I'd rather you didn't speak so lightly about my condition. There is nothing I find amusing about this situation. Very well. I have a task for you, Jonathan. 
Something that will require all your newfound skills. Please, go on. The Pembroke only survives through the generosity of our benefactors. Unfortunately, our main donor has found herself in a bit of a bind. Now, if you could help her out... A spokesman or politician is what you need. That's not my calling. And until I come to understand what has happened to me, I require discretion. Discretion is in order, Jonathan. Lady Ashbury has recently received rather indelicate correspondence that, if revealed, would jeopardize her position. And you would like me to eradicate this threat? By the stole, of course not. I would just like you to pay her a visit. Her ladyship is certainly near the tents outside, tending the sick. You can't miss her. Look for someone impossibly delicate. Accepted. I'll see what kind of trouble Lady Ashbury is in. All right. So we gotta look for uh, an asp. Talk to the hospital benefactor. Okay. What about this? The letter of Rakesh Chadana. Interesting. You guys can read that part of the video. All right. Oh, we've got more hints about this guy. Interesting. What about the uh, warning letter? Okay, we got that. Okay, Stri Strickland. So we've got more hints about Strickland, more hints about the other guy, which is the guy from the morgue. Okay, well, not the morgue, but the cemetery. All right, that's interesting. What about this? Rare species of vampires. There we go. Okay, there we go. Very interesting, boys. This guy has a lot of blood quality, but in order to kill him, boys, I need to be in mesmerized level 6. I'm level 1. How am I supposed to get there, boys? I don't know. Alright, uh, let's see. We've got a lot of XP, but I want to keep it for now. Let's go ahead and do this the next mission really quick. Uh, I'm not sure... I'm not sure how to exactly level up my mesmerize. Maybe I need to... I probably need to go on bed and uh, use the, the XP points in order to do that. Maybe. That's how it works. Alright, let's go, boys. So we've got more. I'm gonna have to go check up on Strickland and the other guy. I'm gonna do that on my free time, though. The flu took my dear wife, Emily. I take comfort knowing we'll soon be together again. <coughs> Mr. Rainfields, that's no way to talk. You're in good hands here, and we'll be up again soon enough. <coughs> Now do me a kindness and get some sleep. I'll be back round later. Your words are kind. The blessings of an angel. You're the sweet, sweet lady of mercy. Good evening, Dr. Reed. It's a pleasure to see you again. You seem surprised. Dr. Swansea has brought me up to speed concerning your recent appointment to Pembroke Hospital. You're a vamp. The lady who saved me that night, before vanishing into thin air. I remember you from the pub with Dr. Swansea. Indeed. Allow me to introduce myself formally this time. My name is Lady Ashbury. I remember you well, in spite of the brevity of our encounter. Glad to see you. I feel played. Swansea fancies uh, vampire. So it seems our Dr. Swansea does indeed have a fascination for creatures of our constitution. Dr. Swansea is a remarkable man. Dedicated, one might say, obstinate. He spent years compiling our bestiary. I hope you're more disposed to answer my questions now. You must have countless questions. But our rather urgent matter first. Swansea has explained. My cover, if you prefer, has been compromised. Uh, patients have given you trouble? Have questions. Patients have given you trouble? Have the patients given you trouble? These poor souls have so little left to live for. I do my best to ease their pain. I don't believe you. 
I gather you have found an arrangement satisfying both ethical and corporal concerns. I was brought up not to snigger at my own jokes, Dr. Reed. What about uh, vampires? I want questions. I need answers. I have questions concerning this condition we share. As a newborn, your hunger for answers is rivaled only by your thirst for blood. But the questions need weight. I'm a scientist. My trade is in the deciphering of mysteries and I need information to feed my mind. I will gladly answer every question you have, but first, prove yourself capable of resolving my predicament without eating the culprit. Without eating? I don't know about that. I'm a vampire after all. That's what I do. All right, I'm here to help you, I guess. He has commissioned me to be your agent in this matter. You could start by explaining what's amiss. These past insufferable weeks, I've been the victim of extortion. I've made a first payment, but the blackmailer grows greedy. I must refuse his most recent demands. Uh, what do you want of me? Why not solve this yourself? Is another vampire threatening you? Why not solve this yourself? If we're dealing with an ordinary criminal, surely you've the means to deal with it yourself, if I may. As immortal tradition doth dictate, all fangs and hypnotic eyes ablaze. The blood would run like a river. That's what I hope to avoid. Violence has a tendency to spiral out of control. Excuse me, but you're a vampire. Aren't you supposed to kill people? I don't get it. You don't have a soul. You're not like a fucking angel in Buffy. But your shit doesn't make sense right now. Who would be so foolish as to threaten you? A kindred spirit. Even if it were the case, and I highly doubt it, a vampire would have asked for something more valuable than money. My suspicions lean toward a patient or their family. What you want from me exactly? What are your expectations. Please be precise. As the newly appointed surgeon of this hospital, you are in an excellent position to ask innocent questions and deftly learn the identity of my blackmailer. All right. So we got we got to talk to everyone basically. Every detail is essential. I'm your man. My embarrassment in this matter is eclipsed only by my shame at having put the hospital at risk. The threat from our anonymous scoundrel is clear. A list of dates. My visits coinciding with the dates of suspicious patient deaths due to massive blood loss. I'll take care of it. Is it true? Is it true? Now aren't you the blunt one? I need blood too. It is only logical. I just need information. Uh, I need blood too. It is only logical. We both are afflicted with a thirst for blood, Lady Ashbury. That is our nature. By vocation, we also have reason to visit the hospital. Logic dictates. In all honesty, I'm not simply a patron to the hospital. My visits serve a dual purpose. Dr. Swansea has been treating my condition with a revolutionary technique of blood transfusion. It seems you are a specialist in the domain. I'll take care of it. Do you know where I should start? If that was the case, I'd settle the matter myself. You could talk to our local gossip, Harriet Jones. Not a pin drops here without her hearing about it. Jones? I'll meet that woman now. Okay. My life as others know, is in your hands, Dr. Reed. I'm sure of your discretion, but I do fear your powers of persuasion will be put to the test. When this is resolved, I'll be your obligé. I'll answer all questions in regards of your condition. Okay, seems interesting then. So we've got plenty of stuff to talk to Ariat in the hospital. I'm going to do that in the next video, boys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm going to see you guys for the next one. Remember to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. Keep it easy.